Hello, friend. Welcome. This is our Java chess project developed in Eclipse. Okay, so in our last video, we create a model class, chess model, and we don't have anything here. Let's start from something model, right? Which is independent from our view and the controller. So um, let's overwrite a two string override a two string method so we can uh, print an object um, of this chess model representing our uh, games state okay so two string yeah all right that so whatever we return here right for example chess state Command D to delete that. Yeah, let's use this one. So we are create our unit J unit uh, test case for this guy. But before that, let's create a a folder for that. Okay, so right click here, new source folder. Follow our convention, right? test like that finish now let's right click this because because we want to test this guy we'll create a test file right test class no actually let's see what we'll create a j unit test case oh yeah so the class yeah it is a class class name is chess model test okay source folder is not source we'll put it here to separate from our um, source code of the app itself now next and uh, yeah we want to test this guy to string finish add j unit 5 library to the build path sure we need that cool you see so by default um the test the two string will fail okay let's make it happen so let's switch to okay i think we can right click this guy and run as j unit test Okay, of course it failed. Now we switch to this view, right? Let's focus on this one so we can use, make it a little bit bigger. So this one failed. And uh, now let's create, okay, so I think we can, we can put this guy here on the right. No. I want it to be on the right like that and we can close the other file because yeah so we have a model here let's create the one so chess model because we share the same uh, build path so it's accessible from our test file so chess model chess model equals new chess model now let's try to print it as well as all print our chess model okay like that we don't need this for now and run it again yeah chess state right here now instead of return that let's return an empty board that will start from we'll use eight by eight dots uh matrix for our uh for our text-based chess board okay so Let's define a string like that. Description 
equals empty and then we'll put a dot here description plus equal a dot right that then we'll return this distribution okay run it a single dot here you see now that's output eight of them right in a row our first row this row this row actually the first row is row seven zero row zero bottom up one two three four five six row seven will be printed out first okay so four column no int colon equals zero first column and uh, column less than less than eight right and the column plus plus and we can highlight that and uh, control shift f to auto automatically format it now let's run it we should be able to see our first row here right row seven now we need uh, eight of them right eight rows so four uh, row starting from can we do this starting from seven and uh, row is greater or equal to just for fun then row minus minus right and the command shift F and don't forget that the line break line break is backslash n now that's short Oh, it works cool so you see the first row is seven and the the last one is zero okay now let's try to put a a label under it right zero one two three four five six seven that's easy we can do this zero one two three four five six seven and try it oh sorry missing the ending semicolon yeah nice right now let's try to add the the label on the left seven yeah going down seven six five four three two one zero we are insert it in in front of each row so um desc plus equal row right no we cannot do that so will change the integer to a string we can use that so how it works before uh, Java concatenates the, the empty string and another string it converts this it converts this this uh, integer to a string for example right seven will become to seven like that is the string then it can concatenate this empty string and that one and we'll output the the string instead of the um the integer now let's try very good and we only need to insert another space at the bottom so here like that now run it 
cool, right? So we can stop here and let's make a commit. And then to staged changes. So implement it. No. Uh, actually, yeah. Implement it. Chess model dot to string for empty chess board. Okay. So we'll add the pieces later. Okay. Commit and push. Very good. Thank you for watching. See you next time.